What's going on guys? Welcome back to Korea. And I've literally loaded up and we've had this. The hype for the hype for the fight between you and Ben Askren is definitely building. We should take the fight when it's offered. It's time, let's do it. Or let's let Askren sit and wait. I'm not getting bullied into anything. So we're gonna do a Vaskrim. Because we already have a fight offer, I believe, which was um Oh, we're four and a half star overall, guys. I didn't notice that. Michael Chiesa, the number two ranked uh, well, we'll wait, um, and then hopefully we'll get a title fight. If we have a title fight after this one, then that will be next episode. If we don't, then um, we will do the next fight this episode as well. And uh, but I want I want to just focus one episode purely 100% on the title fight. So I think it'll be awesome. All right, so this fight's already to high after just that. Um, so if people want to see me and Chiesa throw hands, we're gonna watch some tape. Look at his overall. Hopefully, he's four stars. He is four stars. Okay, I'm not too worried then. I'm not really too worried about that. Um, and as always, we're gonna try and um, get some good stuff going. They will definitely say Chiesa is um, is boxing or uh, not boxing. Sorry, jujitsu of some kind or wrestling. Is is what they'll say for sure. I guarantee it. Nice boxing, yes. Nice boxing. Now just keep building up that damage. Let me see that. Let's go. We're just gonna just gonna get a good camp here today, guys. That's what that's the, that's that's the main focus is. Trying to get a good camp. Oh, wow. yeah. So we want really just try and get that moderate, about. get to that, that peak damage. fitness. Right? Power. I love it. Let's go. Oh, he's he's hurting. Go. He's hurting. He's hurting. He doesn't he doesn't want this. He doesn't want this. He does not want this. Yeah, remember when you used to hurt us, bro? Now look, now look what's happened. It's the other way around, huh? The other way around. Lovely jubbly. That puts us up to the uh, little five evolution points. Nice little start to our camp. No stress. Low fitness. Uh, we had a 40-odd like percent boost on jabs, but our jab is needs 60,000 XP to become five stars. So it's pretty uh, pretty crazy. But we, we, we dropped him. We landed some good shots. I'm happy with that. Let's, uh, let's move on, guys. All right, fighter style, jiu-jitsu as expected. Yeah, I thought it'd be jiu-jitsu or wrestling for sure. Uh, get some fight hype going again. Uh, and then we've got three weeks to train. Hopefully this week we'll get up to moderate. Next week get up to peak. Final week, have a little play around, see what we can get. Right, some sweet science. Let's go. Excellent blocking. Man. Your next opponent is going to be no match for you. All right, we're going to try and land some uppercuts on this guy. So that's part of the... We get a little XP boost if we land uppercuts here. Oh, I don't know. big punch, big punch. I love it, I love it. That'll leave a bruise. We're working, we're working. Hey, fuck you, buddy. We ain't got to do too much here. You know, we'll just yeah, get a bit of work to him. Work on that boxing damage. I love it. Cut the cage off a bit. And 30 to go. Got to love it. Got to love a crane kick. I swear. Got to love it. Didn't land much in the ways of uppercuts. That's how we do it. But we landed a little bit, so I'm not going to be too butthurt about it. That's also eight evolution points added to our uh, to our collection. So hopefully we'll have a good like 20 or so by the end of this camp. And then we're able to... Uh... Well, that's not too bad, actually. Lead uppercut needs a bit of work. Uh, I, honestly, I don't know if we'll actually be able to get that top level jab, to be honest with you guys. like It's going to take so long to do. And our longevity is looking so rough. Um, I'm looking forward to my next career though, where we maybe just jump straight into the UFC, or maybe we stay in the WFA forever. I don't know. I don't know where I'm at yet. I don't know where my brain is at yet. Alright guys, we're going to train with Tyron Woodley here, and the main reason being is, you guys know I love to 
I kind of abuse this thing a little bit. Is it? Should be that. Yeah. We're going to try and land like lots of hooks and stuff here today. I really don't want to knock him out though. Wow, that was really quick. It was obviously based on damage and that almost killed him. All right. A little bit frustrating there. We spent a lot of XP just to get those five things done. I was hoping to level some stuff up, and we literally got fuck all done. That's why I use the hook kick, even though I never use it. A um, little bit frustrating, but it is what it is. We got the uh, five evolution points anyway, so it's not like we got a complete waste. Um, we didn't knock Tyron Woodley out, like we did to Leon Edwards, who is um, currently the champion, I believe. Which is quite funny, because that's going to be like the ultimate build-up fight. Like, it's going to be the biggest hyped fight ever. Alright, All right, we're going to do a bit of Muay Thai here. Let's go in there and crush this. Oh, that's, a, that's annoying. Yes, work on that kickboxing damage. Yes! That's the quick nice, way to do it. Nice. To actually not hit him. Great job today. This might be a good way to abuse it as well. Definitely want to throw the clinch more. That's what we've done in the Gunner Nelson fight. We threw the clinch a good amount. And uh, it worked a fucking treat. Especially being a kickboxer as well. I think we've probably got like the best stats for clinch game. Good, job in there. Your kicks are looking really sharp. good knees nice to the body there as well. Uh, that gets the clinch level up. Then come the fight. Who knows? We could level it up in the fight. You just never know. Um, 13 move evolution. Jesus, really? Clinch needs the body. Yeah, we've got a good amount of XP there. Okay, cool. I'm happy with that. Lead elbow. We've got 10 XP from the lead elbow. Obviously, like I said, there's going to be some camps where we just don't get anything leveled up, guys. It's just the way it be sometimes. You never know what's going to happen. But I feel like this is pretty much the number one contender fight. I think that's where we're at at the minute. We are at the number one contender fight. And I'm fucking looking forward to fighting for that title finally, man. We, we have... We deserve the title, I have to say. All right, All right we're going to finish off with some boxing. All we've got to do is throw some... Oh, he's got to throw body shots against him, and this is the best way to do that. Beautiful combination. I love it. Keep it Hold up. on, where's my... Where's my favourite move? Oh, bro, go away. This is a bit cheesy, I know, but it's, it avoids getting an uppercut like that to the face. Get a nasty combo where he rocks us with some BS like that. That's some bullshit right there. That's some bullshit. And he knows it. And he's about to get knocked the fuck out now. Don't stop now. You got 30 seconds. Awesome combo. That's what we want. Honestly. You want to calm down, bitch? That's what I like to see. All right, we've got 10 evolution points from that, but fuck me, did we just get our shit rocked. That's why I throw body shots at thin air, because he will just catch you with that, especially on this difficulty. And then obviously he fucking dropped us as well. And tried to fucking ground and pound us, which is ridiculous. Fucking sparring partner should not try to do that. Should not try to do that. Especially as he's at the Davis gym. He's not some random visitor. He's at the Davis gym, so he should be fucking, like, visiting us. Uh, not visiting us. He should be being nice. And Davis is happy with that. Should be happy with your famed fighter getting fucking ground and pounded in four ounce gloves. A week before his fight, Davis. Come on. Put your finger out, brother.
All right, my only worry is we've done very little wrestling here. Uh, all we've got to do is escape the clinch. Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. It's funny because this is just not how I fight in the actual fights themselves. I'm like so reckless in sparring. Body. Let's go. Thirty on the clock. Body. Yep, let's stay busy. Oh, lucky fucker. Great job in there. If you land volume like that, you're going to chop everybody down. All right, I'm happy with that. Eight evolution points. Um... Quite a slow camp, to be honest, but it is what it is. We're going to lose a few of those evolution points as well when we uh, uh, spend it on. We have to clear, pretty much clear the cobwebs out of our head because we were seeing stars. So we're going to have to sort our chin strength out, or whatever it could be. It could be, it could affect something else. It could affect footwork. It could affect, affect accuracy. You just never know. We're going to use these final points to see his top moves: chokes, body straight, lead collar, tie clinch, BJJ transitions. All expected. Nothing. Surprise me there, to be honest. We know what he's going to try and do. And we're going to try and keep him at bay. We're going to just keep that head moving. And hope whenever he goes for that clinch, we we move out the way. We slip it and bang. And catch him across the chin. And, you know, work well, I suppose. I suppose that's our, that's our main goal, really. Health. Cardio. That's rough. That's real rough right there. Fuck it. We'll spend it on clinch striking. Let's hope next week, uh, next camp is more successful. So let's get into this fight, guys. All right. You guys know during camp, my, my boy has uh, been a little bit stressed for this number one contender fight. His hair's growing out. His beard's growing out. You know, here's how it is, guys. You ready? All right, Michael Chess is ready. What's this guy's got something new? Yeah, I got something new, baby. I remember to put it on. Let's go. Hair and beard has grown out a little bit. I mean, if he's just going to let me do this, then I'm just going to do it, and I. I think I hurt him, to be honest. I think I've hurt him with the clinch. Oh, what the fuck is happening here, then? I'd, I would not say Michael Chiesa would be fighting like this, to be honest. Right, he's just taken a beating from me already. Alright. He's loving that clinch game at the minute. Good effort. If, if at first you don't succeed, you try, try again. And this guy, now he has a headlock trying to pin his opponent's back down flat onto the mat. Looks so like good. Stay calm. Stay calm. Try to Stay calm. Stay calm. Stay calm. So we've got to do is stay calm. I'm not losing like this. It's not happening. Oh, 
fist here by Chiesa. No, I meant to stuff that. Oh, because what should... Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound starts. Oh, trying to pass here, but... To Bro, get off. Style, he gets denied. Block. Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Oh, pretty good entry there, and he gets the fight to his wheelhouse on the ground. Beautiful takedown. This is not my wheelhouse at all. I don't like being on the ground. And use ground and pound to open up submission opportunities. Strong bottom work here. Bro, I don't like being on the ground with him. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Michael Kies. Hell no. Ten seconds. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here. That's a terrible round for me. I'm gassed already. I can feel it. Oh yeah, no pity path to this guy. This guy's trying to land. He's trying to land. Yeah, I can feel it already. Oh, it's all good though. It's all good. Stay calm. Stay composed. Let's go. You get her in! Fuck's sake. Alright, guys, I apologize about the pause there. It is a sight to behold. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Well, he has certainly found the range. Wow. Shit. I can't do nothing here. Once he's got me down, that's it. I'm just gonna have to just keep denying transitions. Oh my god, hello. Wow, that was pretty phenomenal. Stuff those three transitions in a row. I'm just gonna wait. You can either stand us up or I'll or I'll just keep denying transitions. Alright, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's gotta grab that head or he's going to get blasted. Alright, he's sort of hanging out here unguarded, DC. Not sure if he's trying to bait him in or what, but not great body language here. Shit. Two minutes to go. I need you to take the back and go back. I need you to be active on the ground now. There's one thing you're not doing, bro. You're not doing that with me. Get on his back now. The ref's going to have to stand us up at some point. Nothing is happening. Ref, stand us up. I wish the crowd would stop cheering and start booing. A minute now to go. I'll start this all day. 45 seconds remain in the round. Right, so Let's go. The ground, the Thank fuck. I'm sweating. And we are back underway. Let's go, let's go finish this, guys. Come on. That's a big strike right there. And he comes through with a big knee. We got a fight, folks. What a round. Fuck. Right, I'm gassed. Round, we will go right I'm stressed the about this. With that brutal cut on his nose. Really, really. All right. Come on. Third round underway. Ooh, big shot lands. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, oh big knee. Beautiful diving strike lands. 
Shit, no. Oh, bro, this is not good. Fighter trying to pass here, Ooh, but gets denied. Gets denied. Great job. Great recognition of seeing what your opponent was That's trying so to good. do. So good. I'm nervous. And the referee brings the fight back to Thank fuck. No surprise there. Needed to see more action. Miss with that jab attempt there. Well, there's a takedown attempt. No surprise that he would go for it there, but unable to get the fight to the ground. No, 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 get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. No, no, no. Oh, reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom player. Oh, big combination of This is really not what we want. DC, this could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you got to be very careful when you take... Oh, let's go. ...ground and pound strike. You need a control... Good transition. ...on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes in your point. So good. So good. Arch a good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy and not just busy but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing it. This is stupid. Job. Oh now trying to isolate an arm, DC. He needs to move his hips back to cover. He cannot allow him on that angle. Attack an arm bar. Continuing to try to manipulate He's got me. Here. He's got me. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous, bro. Fucking hell. I'm just going to let him do it. He's got me. Oh, my God. That's just so abusive, the way they done that. Nah, I won that. That's my bad for trying to stack guard him. We won that as well. We had that win. What an incredible result here tonight as you see the winner there celebrating his victory by way of submission. And On the biggest so fight of our career, like really and we lose that. Forward. They needed to not just win, but get the finish, and they certainly got it. To That's win. what happens. He's such a terrific grappler. Every time he is on we would have won that fight as well. We knocked him down. We were out striking him until he can 13 takedowns. Oh, our fault, but fuck's sake. All right, I've fallen down to rank six, and I've been given Ben Askren as my next fight. Um, I mean, we're gonna obviously take it, but I mean, we're starting to be like we're starting to be like Cowboy. I love Cowboy, but he is like all of his big fights, he just can never win them. But fuck it, we'll fight Ben Askren. Like, and let's hope this win gets us the title, because that was honestly that was. <sighs> It's annoying that your stamina gets drained when you deny takedowns. That's what pisses me off the most. Four stars overall. Wrestler, obviously. And we'll, we'll learn his other top moves and stuff. But let's, let's not let it bum us out. Let's fucking get to this and let's win this fucking fight. Alright, guys. We're in the final week of training. Obviously, yeah. Askram and this five-star wrestling, of course. And, uh, yeah, we're here. We're, I didn't talk at all through that whole training. So, you guys didn't see anything. It's probably the first training you never saw. Um, and, yeah, I just kind of want to just focus and just have a breather. Because I was fucking pissed off after that last performance. Right, we're going to level up our takedown defense and get into this fight, man. Like, that's all we can do at this point. Get into this fight. Try our absolute best here. And uh, try and put Ben Askren away and get this title fight. Alright, 
We didn't even bother getting a haircut. That shit's just grown out at this point. Still up. And with that, we are underway in round one. As many of you know, this fighter lost his last fight by submission. To the surprise of some, he was submitted despite being the betting favorite that night. So all eyes are on him tonight. The pressure is on him as he not only tries to maintain his spot on this UFC roster, but to prove that he can contend with the top 15 guys in this division. That one snuck in. Nice strike. So they are in the clinch here early. Could make I can't imagine astrin has got a very good chin. Tonight. Those knees aren't just for effect. Those are doing real damage. Well, he told us on Thursday, he'll get paid for the next 15 for a long time. Honestly, man. Right, a good ground and pound As a kickboxer, what can I do against these wrestlers? You can just throw punches to keep the referee off. Oh, and he just this fucking keeps. To be effective, to throw there we go. That one was quicker. Solid strike on the ground. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue. See, this is not where I want to be either, to be honest. He gets the fight to his wheelhouse on the ground. Beautiful takedown into the He's been stuffed that, what a surprise. Look for him to posture and use ground and pound to open up some mission opportunities. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here for Bob. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. 37 total strikes have already landed for Ben Allen. Oh, he's got a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he lands. Great job. Oh, big left hook there. Let's fucking go! Come on! Fuck you, Askren. Oh. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect Boom. shot to end the fight. Boom. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent oh. saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Right, Let's to go. Here, we're gonna find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. Honestly. That was the most stressful fight I've had. Two high-level wrestlers and jiu-jitsu fighters back to back. The opponent was in there every step of the way, and in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, I know on his stand-up he's just gonna be sloppy. That's why I caught him with the, the head kick, the crane kick, then the head kick again. Stressed after that, bro. Stressed. Oh. Thank fuck. We got beaten up as well at the start of that. We've never gone on a two losing streak. I don't intend on doing it now. Oh god, he just got me down. Just fucking four takedown attempts that quick as well. That's just... That's why I didn't want to fight Askren to be honest. That is why. But I'm glad we put him away there. Honestly, I... Honestly, couldn't be happier that we've fucking put him away. I'm so relieved. Bang, through that overhand. I ain't bothered about no bonuses or nothing. We ain't we ain't got that much long left. We ain't got much longer left in this game, guys. Like our longevity is running on fumes. We need to get the title. I just want to fight Leon Edwards. I just want to fight Leon Edwards. Number three rank, please just give me the title shot. Please don't make me fight Chiesa or Askren again. Just give me the title shot. What? Decline? Absolutely not. That's not happening. I'm not fighting the 11th ranked fighter in the division. I'm not fighting the 5th ranked fighter in the division. No. No, absolutely not. I will either fight the number one ranked or the champion. Let's go, except right away. Six weeks to fight. Okay, guys, that's going to be in the next episode, obviously. Um, 
yeah, let's just, let's just, I saw footage of you and Edward sparring. If you tease it to the media, it could really hope the fight, but that's your call. Let's do it. Let's do it. We have to. The fight height's already at medium. So the drama leading up is there's been a legend of Edwards getting the worst of it in sparring. You're fucking damn right. They won't work on a real fighter like me. I guess Leon Edwards needs all the competency and get that straight. I can't believe continue about that session, especially when he knows I have tape. Ooh, it's a fucking full on rivalry now, guys. Oh. Get that hype up, baby. Talk about laying claim to, to a top contender spot. It's already at a high hype. You'd love to see it. All right, guys. Well, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And join us for the next episode where hopefully we strip Leon Edwards of the title. And after 31 professional fights, a 32nd professional fight, we can become the UFC champion. And it's frustrating because we had such a good run inside the UFC. To lose that way against GSA in a fight we'd already pretty much won. It was rough. But it is what it is, guys. We're going to carry on fighting. Carry on winning. Probably not become the GOAT because of our longevity. But it is what it is, guys. We're going to carry on having fun. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.